Hey guys, what's up? It's Jonathan, and I'm reaching out today real quick because I made a bit of an error with my fig cuttings. So I want to go over that with you. Uh, I went a little bit too young, apparently. They needed to be a little bit thicker and much darker in color. Um, that will, uh, you know, guarantee you more of um, a successful cutting. So that's the first thing. Uh, next thing is I uh, should only have one leaf, not two. That is, uh, again, uh, doesn't, you know, allows more energy to be um, utilized to, for plant growth or root growth versus, you know, sustaining two giant leaves. So I'm going to cut that back today and then I'm going to, you know, show you real quick what they look like and then we're going to bag them right back up and then we're going to start all over and then, you know, the greener ones that I have are a little harder to take or they take a little harder to root so that's why the other ones are better. But I'm going to show you real quick, I'm going to bag them up and also you should get a tray like the one behind me. Um, this way you can put them in there and you don't have to worry about watering uh, through the top. You're not going to take the bags off or anything. You can just water through the bottom. So yeah, I'm going to show you real quick. Uh, I'm going to cut them off, the extra leaf, and show you real quick and then we're going to bag them up and send you guys on your way. Alright, here we go. Here's our cuttings. As you see, I already trimmed them back to one leaf each. And I wanted you guys to get a look at the stems so you can see that they are thinner than they should have been. Should have been a little bit thicker and brown in color. So these are gonna be a little harder to get to root, but it's all right. We're still gonna give it a shot. We're just gonna bag these up, put them in our awesome tray here. And again, always remember to have your uh, nice sharp shears to get everything done so you get a clean cut. Okay guys, as you can see, we're all bagged up and the plants are in their tray and they're ready to go for their second round. So, you know, this was a small little setback, you know, keep in mind when you're doing the cuttings next time, make sure they're darker in color, more brown, thicker, and it should root a lot easier than what I'm probably going to have to deal with. But, you know, and also keep in mind, cut little slits at the bottom of your bags over there and keep them in a sunny area. Other than that, you should be good to go. Uh, I'm going to try and stop back in again this weekend at the Fox Hollow Farm to see Larry and Heather. And I'm going to purchase some of Larry's cuttings that have already taken. They already have roots. So you guys are going to be able to see exactly what the real cutting should look like or a proper cutting should look like uh, once the roots have taken. So that's going to be pretty cool. And then I'll have some fig, tree, fig trees guaranteed. So, you know, mistakes are awesome. You know, they help us learn. They help us grow. So I'm glad I was able to make the mistake for you. You guys didn't have to. And that's, you know, that's what it should all be about. So we can learn from one another and then we can teach one another and this, this just gets bigger and bigger. So thanks again for watching. You guys are awesome. And, uh, you know, as always, much love, Godspeed, and I'll see you soon.